Trade it and upgrade it now at Appalachian Wireless and receive up to $700 off when you trade your old eligible device in and upgrade to a new iPhone 14 Pro Max or Samsung S23 Ultra on an unlimited Appalachian Advantage plan. Because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. The University of Pikeville's Film and Media Arts program will be screening the independent documentary film Hazing at the Appalachian Center for the Arts on Tuesday, April 4th. What I really like about this film tour and the organization that puts it on, South Arts, is that they are committed to telling stories set in rural America. Um, I think nationally we don't get a lot of representation of rural stories and I see that here in Appalachia. We see the, the, the Appalachian people constantly being misrepresented historically throughout popular media and so to me it's very refreshing to see an organization that prioritizes telling stories about rural America. The film places university hazing culture under a microscope to explore a world of toxic masculinity, violence, binge drinking, and institutional cover-ups. At our screening of hazing, we're going to have a Q&A session at the end where we will have guest speaker Natalie Bullock-Brown, who is the producer of the film. Uh, she has a lot of industry experience, worked for many years even on a Ken Burns production, and so she will be there to take questions with our students, and we're also going to have her come by one of our classes and speak to our students on campus. It's rare to get to see an independent film here in Pikeville that's also represented by the filmmaker, and we just hope we have a nice crowd. Hazing will be screening at the Appalachian Center for the Arts on Tuesday, April 4th at 6 p.m. For more information, you can visit UPike FMA on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Dean.